Hey guys, uh, this is Icy and today I'm going to be playing Free For All on Terminal. But uh, before I go on with gameplay commentary and such, I'd like to take a moment to introduce myself and this channel. So, uh, my actual name is Omri and I'm nearly 18 and live in Israel. Uh, I just began my last high school year so I've got a lot of free time to do this kind of stuff. I'm new to the whole comment editing field so I mostly take advice from videos I watch online and, well, my friends. Uh, and they give me a lot of great feedback and uh, well this goes out to you guys thanks for being so supportive and awesome uh, yeah what else um, as you can probably figure out uh, I'm mostly talking Modern Warfare 2 videos but also some Minecraft and well basically any game I think is worth posting um, yeah so uh, Terminal I really like this map uh, I think it's the first one I've ever played in, in Modern Warfare 2. Uh, and you know, it just got something for everyone. I mean, uh, there's there's the close quarters, uh, which are like the rooms and shops and everything like that. And you also have the huge uh, outside area, this one. Uh, and it's pretty cool, I, I really like it. Ah, uh, oh, this guy took my crate. I hate people who take my crate. It's a counter UV. I mean, it's not even that useful. Okay, it's kind of useful. Uh, but still, I mean, come on. You have to steal a crate. Anyway, um, Terminal is very well suited for a game type like Free For All because it's pretty large and spawns are balanced for the most part. Uh, so I really like playing on it and uh, free for all is one of the greatest modes to play here. Uh, my setup is my regular free for all class uh, featuring the TAR-21 with full metal jacket. I like this rifle for two main reasons. Uh, the first is it's relatively low recoil that allows me to be accurate even with the iron sights and second reason is that it's actually an Israeli assault rifle. Uh, TAR is actually an abbreviation for Tavor assault rifle and that's pretty cool in my opinion uh, that a country like Israel gets featured in a worldwide game. It's pretty exciting. Um, now my perks are uh, Slide of Hand Pro for the quick recharging, Stopping Bow Pro for the quick killing of people and ninja pro for those awesome ninja moments you'll see what I'm talking about soon uh, so as you may have noticed uh, I'm having these weird lag spikes I think they're caused by the fact I recently switched my PC to wireless connection but uh, I can't tell for sure uh, for the time being we'll have to live with it I know I do uh, yeah so my strategy around this map is mostly defensive and as you can see for a pretty major part of this game I just hang out outside uh, watching my own back <laughs> but obviously to get kills you have to be somewhat aggressive so I just try to you know merge between the two in a way that doesn't get me killed too much and this guy right here gives me my uh, hair strike uh, yeah. So I also decided to use my Predator and I almost did this guy but then Wee Predator fail. Gotta love them. And I also use my stealth bomber. So yeah. I'm about to run out of ammo as you see and the when I take out these two guys I'm totally out. So what I do is I just grab one of the weapons and that's a tip I can give you because like if you, you're you just out of ammo and you're not gonna get any just grab another weapon and keep on killing I mean I know it's not as good as the weapon you're used to but I found out it's uh, it's an offer replacement to to be of use until you die so uh, yeah Unless you have Scavenger Pro, but in my opinion, that's a waste of, of a perk, seriously. I mean, you don't need it. It's better to have Slate of Hand or uh, Marathon, whichever you like. 
so yeah, we got uh, like I think uh, I'll do the math. Twenty-two kills by now, and a game consists of uh, thirty kills. Uh, so just here I noticed the score and I started to get really stressed uh, I didn't want to to come out second or third I mean and ah, ninja yeah I like that so that's why ninja pro is useful you see uh, now this part of the game gets really annoying people just kill me all over uh, can't go anywhere without getting killed this guy just pops out of nowhere and shoots me with his what was it? Rafik, I think, I'm not sure. And then I get knifed. Bad luck, bad luck. Finally I get back on track and die again. Yeah, lovely. So, free for all, I don't play it too often because it, it takes a lot of attention and I like to be, well, as calm as possible as, uh, when I play and I find it really hard to do in a game mode like this where everybody shoots at you, you don't have anyone by your side it's every man for himself uh, so while that is fun sometimes it can get annoying uh, but yeah, I mean if I won the match then it's probably worth posting it, right? right? I hope so, <laughs> don't kill me uh, so I'm like four kills away from winning and at this point I'm like going crazy in front of my keyboard. You don't see me but uh, I shit you not I was pretty excited and this guy is like yeah I don't like them they just take a room and stay there and whoever comes is welcome because you know they'll just kill him uh, but what can you do? It's part of the game, huh? As much as this map is ideal for this t type of gameplay, it also has a lot of camping spots and that can get pretty annoying. But, uh, you know, if I'm good enough, I'll just get over it. So, s two kills away from winning, and my... Uh, the guy before me is now six kills. No, six kills? Four kills away from winning. And only one left. And, well, I want. Uh, I want. Uh, I want up all the details. I get the kill. But it's pretty annoying that the actual kill cam at the end is uh, like laggy. I got a lag, uh, a lag spike just when the kill cam was on so you see that that's what I'm talking about and then just knife him somehow. Well anyway um, 30 to 15 not the best not too bad. Uh, that's it uh, I hope you guys enjoyed it and uh, I'll see you next time. Thanks for watching.